I'm Mike Lombardo. You may remember me from your bedroom window last week. Are you gonna tell anyone? When I'm not committing crimes against humanity or evading the police, I run an independent film company called Rules Splatter Productions. We're dedicated to putting the laughter back in slaughter. Now, despite my previous philosophy of having no identifiable markings, I've decided that for the fifth anniversary of Real Splatter, I'm getting a tattoo. So let it be known that Thursday, July 17th, in the year of our Lord, 2008, at 4 p.m., that's 6 a.m. Friday for our Australian friends. That's right, folks. No body, no crime. You ain't never gonna find him. <sighs> so I'd like to welcome you to a mini-documentary I like to call Dr. Chud Gets In. And let me be the first to assure you that if this film doesn't touch you, I will. But seriously, folks, uh, menacing sexual advances aside, this is a pretty scary time for me. I've never had a tattoo before. I've been told that it's either completely painless or excruciatingly agonizing, so I guess we'll find out tomorrow, won't we? But rest assured, the camera's going to be right there catching my every reaction. So if I cry like a bitch, well, you're going to see it. So I'll see you tomorrow. Later. We're standing outside of Sector 5 tattoo right now. We're about to go in and uh, see the artwork. Pretty goddamn nervous about this. I haven't seen the final artwork yet, so hopefully it looks good. And, uh, well, let's go. Basically, we're going to try to do this all in one session, uh, that part of it anyway, and then uh, we'll set up the second session to do the rest of the detail and all the coloring. Um, I don't know how well you can see this, but the idea of this is that Dr. Chud is ripping out of my arm, and my skin has been torn away, and underneath is the gas mask with film snaking its way out. Uh, so this, uh, this should be pretty interesting. Uh, as soon as he turned on that tattoo gun to test it out, my heart sped up by about eight times. Uh, somehow thought of a needle repeatedly puncturing my skin at like a thousand times a minute isn't the most appealing thing for me, but uh, we're gonna find out in about a minute and a half. Need a break to flood the half. Can do. Too bad at all. It just feels like uh, someone's taking a needle and stabbing it at me a lot. Kind of stings. Not nearly as bad as I was thinking it was gonna be. Have you ever had anyone pass out on you? On the arm, or just because it was close to the bone? Uh, just from the nerve. Being nerve. Yeah, I definitely think that the uh, outlining starts working that. Completely out of heart. The power lights are out. Gargano's is uh, 
dark. Oh. Here is dark. We're stuck here waiting for the power to come back on. So this couldn't have happened at a worse time, but uh, <laughs> we're, we're not nearly as fucked as a lot of places are. So I'm just okay, so uh, I was dropping off uh, some of Dr. Chud's good friends at uh, the fitness park, and I uh, all of a sudden saw an explosion underneath my car, and uh, I don't know when exactly the line fell, but the power line uh, fell, and I just happened to run over it right when uh, he was uh, getting his tattoo Which done. As you can see, there is no power. Not at Gargano's, the sign is dark. Aiden Zug's over there, no power. So it's about 7.30, the power just randomly came back on. Uh, it was off for what, a half an hour? 45 minutes? Half an hour, 45 minutes in the middle of my tattoo. So uh, we're gonna hopefully get started and try to do a little bit more of this. to start uh, doing the blood on the tattoo, uh, so this is uh, pretty exciting. We can always add more blood. <laughs> 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 Well, this is the end result of the first session. That was about, I don't know, maybe three hours, three and a half. Um, we did a lot of, we did all the outlining, we did a lot of the black shading, um, and then we just did, we did the red of the, uh, the white highlights for the blood. Uh, down here, we're gonna, next time, the next session, in the, I think two or three weeks from now, is uh, we're doing the film. There's gonna be a lot of film coming out from these ribs, and uh, this is a piece coming up right there. We're really going to make this pop out. We might do a little bit of shading with some green and blue to make it really look disgusting. Because the idea is that, you know, Dr. Chud is under my skin, so we're going to work on the skin rips a lot next time. Really make them pop out, maybe add some more blood. Uh, this has blown my expectations out of the water. I could never have hoped that it would be this fucking awesome. You ever want to get a tattoo, come to Sector 5. Chris Hall is unfucking believable And uh, I'll have that address for you in a little bit. Uh, but anyway, that's it for today. Um, I guess I'll see you in two weeks.